The following podcast has been brought to you by Audible.com. Sign up now using the URL audibletrial.com forward slash TTV to get a free audiobook of your choosing. We recommend Brick by Brick, how Lego rewrote the rules of innovation and conquered the global toy industry. You may recognize this as one of the sources we use in our show, Bionicle Autopsy. Remember, that's audibletrial.com forward slash TTV. Enjoy the show. Five, four, three, two, one, sink. Sink, sink, sink. sink. Shut up. <laughs> What's up? What's up, everybody? Hello and welcome to episode 189 of the Party TTV Girl. podcast. Yeah, coming Party Girl. 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 I did it after Apple. the number, okay? No, no you no, didn't. No. You did no, you not even wait for the number to finish. Yeah, you, you interrupted him, exactly. dude. You cut him off. I mean, do that. Yeah, listen, you did it wrong. Purple, your newbie is showing, okay? Well, listen, kid, it was a good effort, but uh, maybe next time, all right? <laughs> GG, try again next week. <laughs> but no, how, uh, how's everybody doing this fine Saturday morning, usual recording time? <laughs> oh, man, yeah. I'm doing so good. Can't, can't you hear yeah, it? Dude, My voice I actually feel so a lot the day. more energized. <laughs> like, I am so pumped. Yeah. We're doing this at like shining. 11 like at now, night. Now it doesn't sound like I... Now it doesn't sound like I have a throat full of boogers, you know? I oh, yeah, me too. all three meals of the day. I'm Maybe if you good, woke up at, like, we sh- a normal time, you would be fine, Ben. Well, maybe if recording time wasn't so early in my time zone, then, you know. <laughs> to, in Ben's defense, yeah, it's pretty early compared to the rest of us. Yeah. Uh, well, come like, on, uh, man. You guys are forcing me to wake up for school. <laughs> yeah, on a he weekend, does a, he does have a bit of a point. Real. Like for me, it's like eleven ish, but for Ben, it's like what? How early? Too yeah. early. Yeah, it's like and right now. It's we're like nine. We night. usually start at like nine thirty <laughs> my time. Before it was oh. ten. Ten, that was fine. Nine thirty. Come on, man. That half hour breaks everything. <laughs> All the scheduling it does, in the world. Man. It forces me to wake minutes. up a whole hour earlier. Early. That's like, yeah, if, if through the course of this podcast we sound, start to sound tired, that's why we're recording this at night, directly coming off of, like, April 1st, because hashtag dating the video. Yay. Sounds like a plan, everybody, but, uh, no. It's nice. 1224 we a.m. For- on April 2nd, 2016. I'm real happy for you, Purple. I'm real happy. <laughs> I'm not. Wow, even Purple's talking a lot more. This is going to be a good episode. I'm never I happy. <laughs> I we got a bar. feeling. We know. You don't know anything, Purple. Don't pretend like you know me. I oh. am <laughs> not for, for no. no. <laughs> okay, all right. Take your Calm time down. there. Calm down. Before we get too far uh. in this crazy podcast of ours, let's go ahead and introduce ourselves to our amazing fan base. I'm Essenac. <laughs> wow! <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> in. in before, in before, Messi and Var sound exactly the same. <laughs> uh, but no, for real, I'm, I'm Messi. I'm Varderan. I'm LJ. I'm Kahi. I'm Venom. And I'm Purple Dragon. And once again, this is Two TV One Eighty Nine. As Kai so eloquently put near the beginning of the episode, we're heading up to that big two zero zero or whatever you said. Oh yeah! It's like it's gonna yeah, be a, it's yeah, gonna be a yeah. fun event. Two hundred class. We're you know, scooting up. I gotta say, it's really nice reclaiming my place as third in the list because there was an episode you guys did like two weeks back, and I it wasn't was fun. there. And like, I really like that episode. <laughs> Man, screw you! It was an irregular episode. <laughs> it, it was an episode. <laughs> It like the one episode many video. years back where I was the host because you weren't around, Meso. Yeah. Mean, like a year and a half Dang. ago, half the week. Oh, that was for half yeah. the week, wasn't it? I thought there was one before that. I'm, I'm sure, sure there was. probably it's funny was. funny because like, you're like, yeah, remember that time I was the host? You know, when the week when all the main hosts were away, <laughs> I was the backup. <laughs> See, that's literally what that means, half the week. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> In, in Remember when you were the main host back when IBZP was a thing? I don't, because it was so quick. It was there and okay, it was listen, gone. Listen, pal. <laughs> because that's why we ended IBZP. Yeah. It, it was... After we episode. ended... Kai, you weren't even around for that. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. Like, I'm saying, I'm I was even take credit for something you weren't involved week. in. <laughs> All right. So, Speaking uh, of let's things... Go ahead, let's go ahead and do our plugs. 
Hey everybody, what's up guys? If you're watching this on YouTube, what are you doing? If you watched our last episode on YouTube, you have no clue what the heck went on on the boards, what went on on the podcast, why there is a Civil War, April Fool's trailer, or anything. What are you doing? You're so behind the times. Dude, the podcast is free. Go to Vessel.com at Vessel.com forward slash to TTV channel and you can watch the podcast for free when it comes out. Not a week later. Why are you torturing yourself by using YouTube? Go to Vessel. Also, while you're there, feel free to uh, you know, submit you know, maybe $3 a month and you get some access to uh, maybe some, you know, the rest of our content for a week in advance. Or alternatively, you can also do $19.99 a year, which is much, much cheaper if you're planning on doing it for a longer period of time. Yay. Mm-hmm. So you do that, you get to help out the show, you help us you help us make videos just like this one, more podcasts, more awesome stuff, more awesome content, and just general fun times and happiness to be had. That's Vessel.com forward slash the TTV channel. Go Yo. to it now. It's pretty great. You can get a bunch of exclusive series, including you know, Undertale, Purple, and Var. Var on Purple. What are uh, you say? Yay! And, uh, and pretty soon, I need to hopefully... Go gag. Hopefully by the time this video has come out, that it actually happened, but the re- triumphant return of the TTV after show. Finally! <laughs> the series is like Maze of so Shadows 2.0. We're it, carving it through is. the backlog of episodes that we recorded but never uploaded, and then we're going to start doing it on a regular basis again. So. I, I think like we we have a good... We have someone working on it now. And Hashtag I hope we should Viper. be up. Yeah, we, we have someone working I wasn't gonna, on it. I, listen, I wasn't going to say Viper because just in case it never comes out, I didn't want to, like Viper to take the blame with the fans <laughs> for it. Um, Dang. Kahi, like, her, was Kahi, Viper. her name is, is Viper, not Kahi. Her name is Fluffy. Yeah. Her <laughs> name is Fluffy. Leave Fluffy alone. <laughs> oh, man. Wow. So, guys, what have we been doing well, a lot. Uh, I don't know. We just did a bunch of stupid April Fool's stuff. Hey, don't call it stupid. You're stupid. You're right. It wasn't stupid. Your face is stupid. Oh wait, Shut you wear a up. mask. Yeah, there we go. Ha! Oh, wow, that was such a meaningful contribution to this discussion. Purple, please. Ah, uh, yeah. You're welcome. Proceed. <laughs> I guess it should. It is worth mentioning that uh, if you tuned into last week's podcast. Maybe a little confused, especially if you don't use the message boards or didn't check the channel recently. Yeah. Don't to, worry. To this get... episode, you're going to get the full scoop. So yeah. I guess it, since it, now this is, it's Monday, the the day, a you know, couple of days after April Fool's now. I mean, it's probably you... Tuesday, but... Shut your <laughs> uh, No, it is not probably Tuesday. It's Monday for literally everybody that's in the U.S. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, I mean, if we're being technical right now, it's Saturday. Look, purple, yeah. we're not in the South America. The last episode came out at, like, 9 p.m. It was Monday. Shut up. Or you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Now, Civil War is over with. That was all uh, That was all joke, everybody. Uh, that, was a, that was for April Fool's. That was the setup for April Fool's. Yep. Which is, I mean, I thought it was kind of obvious, but we were, I guess we were a little convincing last episode. Some people some, definitely some people. thought maybe, maybe, we maybe were really on the fighting. episode. The podcast served the intended purpose of being a temporary misdirection for those thinking it was a prank. Yeah. <laughs> it was just like there, some subtle thug. There were some people that got a bit kerfuffled that we were having an argument on the podcast, and then we were having an <laughs> argument on the message boards. Really, if you wanted to get the entire uh, umbrella of this prank... And stand under everything and, and really get everything, you would have to have listened to the podcast and been a user on our message boards to get everything. Pretty much. Yeah, to right. get to get the gist of the entire prank. It was like a two, um, two, two pronged thing. It was like, yeah, it's primarily yeah, for the message board. I, 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 you thought, like, man, these people are really unprofessional for bringing us out in the open. Yeah, it's because it's a joke. Yeah, it was a joke. <laughs> it, you know, honestly, yeah. this, the, the whole the whole joke gave me a lot of perspective on our audience and how there, there's mm. a lot of people that like to pretend like they know what's going on. <laughs> there's also um, a lot of people that like memes. <laughs> yeah, there's that too. But like, okay, so... Of. Like the the plan throughout the week, it was a multifaceted joke. We did the uh, we did oh, we yeah. first we started out the topic on uh, things you dislike about the channel, um, where LJ opened up about how he dislikes you know feeling the need to keep his or to take off his mask during video yeah, videos so that require faces I posted, and stuff. I posted that I didn't appreciate everyone in TTV's pressure to take off the mask, and I was bemoaning right. that, going like, oh, yeah, and gosh, that started so this annoying. like quote-unquote argument in that topic where like all Which, the... Which, uh, by the way, I mean, 
precursor. We had planned this out like months and months in advance because of Civil War coming out this year. Yeah. It wasn't just a thing where LJ just posted out of the blue. We had been planning this for a long while. And the whole thing was staged. The, yeah, um, the whole thing was completely staged from the beginning. Yeah, so like we were arguing in that topic, and um, that was that was kind of fun. That was when we were still kind of under the guise of actually trying to sort of make it seem real, though. But at like, the it was same an time, just scenario. But there was like a grain of truth buried, right? That we tried to like bring out. <laughs> yeah, so it's like it, it, it's like we we were convincing enough to where I guess people would feel like it was probably a real argument. But we felt like the argument itself was so ridiculous <laughs> that most people wouldn't actually take it seriously, which was the case. A lot of people guessed that it was part of a April Fool's setup long yeah. before uh, Ma- the mainly real because joke was of the timing of it. It was yeah. about it was roughly a week before April first. Which is what I really wanted to happen. I wanted us to stretch it out for the payoff. What day was that? Was that Friday or Saturday? Uh, it was Friday. Uh, Friday. So. It, yeah, then it was, it was Friday. Was... No, because it wasn't Saturday. Because it was Saturday, we would have done it after the podcast. Yeah, you're right. It was yeah. Friday, and then yeah, we did the argument on the podcast. Right. Like, so yeah, that was Friday. So that was exactly a week and a day before April Fools. So we did that argument mm-hmm. on the on the uh, boards, and then we did the podcast the following day, which we recorded on Saturdays. Where we continue that argument, quote unquote, on the uh, podcast, and we actually had a verbal back and forth debate mm-hmm. that wasn't released on Monday. So during yeah. that Sunday, we kind of just continued talking on the topic and kind of playing along with the uh, argument, the idea uh-huh. that LJ wants to keep his identity, and me and Kahi want him to take off the mask, that thing. Yep. Um, yeah. And during that time, a lot of people either realized it was a joke, played along, and there were a few people <laughs> that was <laughs> that com- b- b- very very much believed it, and were very upset that we were fighting. Oh, we were yeah. really upset. <laughs> and, and some, Which some I, people, I, I found kind of hilarious. Like there are the things you're like, oh, guys, if I can't believe they're doing this. It's so <laughs> unprofessional. I don't think LJ should die, come out and said this kind of thing. I think Var and LJ are be, or Var and Kahi are being. Really mean. Yeah, there's like, a lot of right, opinions. Listen. Like, all right, yeah. come on now, really. <laughs> but yeah, it's like uh, there's there are some people that it, I I just thought it was kind of funny that the uh, the criticism for the most part was, oh my god, they're so unprofessional. They're like spilling their air out on yeah, and why hop, are they on the doing topic. Why are they doing, like why are they doing children? This? Oh my and god! And then they would join in the fight. <laughs> yeah. And then they immediately <laughs> wanted to throw in their two cents. Get up on the yeah, it was so funny. Like, how could you listen, guys do you guys this in the so public immature. eye? Now let me tell you how. <laughs> like, oh my god. <laughs> it was funny. But um so that that was a thing. People believed us for a bit there. And uh, it was kind of fun kind of leading people on a bit, but it was always interesting to see like the people that picked up on the fact that it was a joke, but you also had those people that were kind of like they're like, oh, I, I I figured out this was a joke before anyone else figured out it was a joke. They were like the, the joke April Fool's hipsters of the topic. <laughs> wow. They were like, no, no, I, I called this. There was, there were a couple people that did call it from the beginning, and they deserved that yes. credit where they're like, all right, yeah, no, Maple. you actually called this. But Maple, there, literally the very first yeah. post on the topic. No, Ma- Ma- it was Maple, Maple deserves that because that was his initial reaction, and that's, he called it. But other yeah. people were like, they were like, I can't believe they're doing this after. It's like, yeah, I knew it was an April Fool's joke. It was just too much. <laughs> they were like, all right, listen. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> yeah, I figured, you know, yep. like. <laughs> there was also a certain group of people that I found interesting, and I also appreciate it. They were like, well, this is a joke, so I'm going to, and I'm pretty sure it's a joke, so, but I'm going to play along because it's funny, but on the off chance it's a legit issue, I'm also going to offer helpful feedback. <laughs> Yeah, those like, people you know, had their heads yeah. on right that was yeah, the, thumbs, yeah thumbs up for you guys hey, there nice. you go now, now there were a lot of legitimate good ideas and like solutions about lj's mirror and like how to yeah, fix yeah the there problem. were and and like a lot of people really wanted to pitch in and offer their thoughts on my mask and i i think One it's needless to say cowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah some people thought i should wear like a half mask like a reverse vahi but I think well, I could I could I could see the Batman cowl thing because I remember someone posted a picture of a um, Batman's helmet from BBS and how it looked kind of like a mirror. Oh yeah, so yeah, I can yeah. imagine. I mean, really, the, the big thing with the mirror is that it just doesn't need that huge part in the middle that comes in between like the mouth area. If you just took that part out, you could just have like your mouth there and you would look like a Batman yeah. person basically. Break the mirror, LJ. Break it. Yeah, Bar made that mouth. for me. I'm not going to break it. that at all. Shoot yeah, it. Uh, that's Shoot too much it, money. man. <laughs> Yeah, I think the uh, overwhelming yeah, the- majority of folks wanted me to keep the mask, which is fine. That's the intention anyway. Right. But- no one was actually like, Elder needs to take the mask off. But, I was, um- man. I'm getting sick of that thing. 
Do you? And then there were a couple it? people who like because I bet you up sweat the... in that. <laughs> you, You're not gonna you clean wear it? it, so what do you care? That's Is disgusting. You You're disgusting. It? Like, say, say LJ is out on the field. He's at, and it's like a really hot day. His sun is beaming. It's practically like a drought. The it's dude... not like he wears the mask outside. <laughs> no, no, you LJ's say that. Mask, he's like you a say part that. of him. And yet, LJ, what are you gonna do when we get to Brick Fair? That is true. You're gonna wear the mask all the time. You know, you know where I'm gonna wear the mask. You know where I'm gonna wear the mask in the air conditioned convention center. Oh yeah, air con. What if the air conditioning well, I mean, is like, broken? What if we're goofing off outside, man? What are we gonna do then? What if we have a meetup with the fans in a park? You guys are totally gonna let look that creepy, be a thing. but he's gonna smell creepy too. <laughs> I am going to <laughs> smell <laughs> just fine. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going, going to wear like lilacs. I'm gonna wear LJ <laughs> cologne. So. Oh. I'm gonna wait, is, uh, wait, 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 no, I, listen. See, that's the Are you, problem. Wait, stop, 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 stop. Okay, okay, okay stop, stop. So, make is, room for King Kahi, I yeah, guess. Yeah, listen, <laughs> listen. Just stand, I, stand I, I just want to, I want to process the conversation. this conversation. Hey, Moses trying to divide the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> listen, no. did LJ just say his solution to, sm to, to smelling bad is that he's going to put cologne that smells like himself? <laughs> Is that, is that the point? LJ Cologne makes you smell like you. That, you That's why it's LJ You gotta understand, Cologne. Kahi. I didn't say that LJ Cologne smelled like me. I just said it was LJ Cologne. The implication is it smells like you. <laughs> would you what, what, what are you. what are you supposed to smell like? It's gonna smell like, I don't know, Bionicle characters. So I guess <laughs> I, I LJ really Cologne. wish. No, 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 it's really going wish. to smell like Bionicle characters. Now please allow me. The perfect answer if only this podcast wasn't censored. <laughs> the scent of loneliness and cardboard. <laughs> I'll drink alone. <laughs> but no. Anyway. I, I feel like I smell like a wet that, dog. Uh, <laughs> uh okay. But yeah, All right. Well, back to, back to the joke. Back to the joke. That was an interesting uh yeah, segue. Okay, segue. Um, what was what I was saying was um there were also the couple of people that like realized it was a joke, but then they also were like, Wow, this is the dumbest joke ever. Really? You're just gonna pretend to fight? That's dumb. Yeah. As if they like knew, you know, yeah. the plans. For every, the every, they knew everything was gonna happen. Yeah, like that. I, like there were some people that were telling us, guys, this is such a bad joke. This is what you should do. And then everything they listed were, was like everything we were planning on doing. Yeah, yeah. It's like guys, you're doing it wrong. Why aren't you starting it like on April first? I'm like, come on, man. We had like a mega event plan. This yeah, is such a just... large thing. It, like we we could have copped out, and we could have just been okay. On April first, we're gonna change all our avatars to Marvel characters, and that's gonna be the joke. We're gonna like fight for a couple hours. Yeah, that's no fun. That's no fun at all. We also wanted to integrate the channel, and we also wanted to integrate the message boards, and we also wanted there to be plausible reasons, so there was the slightest bit of doubt at whether it was real or not. But we also didn't want to be predictable and do it on April first. Right. That that's so. that so we still have a bit of the fools part in the April Fools. So like, you know, still the tricking part. Mm -hmm. But only for a short while. The rest of it was mostly just joking and having fun. But I feel like oh, the yes. way we handled it was really fun cuz then after after uh, Monday podcast, I think it was was it Tuesday or Wednesday when Tuesday. we f finally did the mask reveal. It was Tuesday because it was after like the podcast had been up for Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. It was a, it was a twenty four hour period after the podcast where people listened to it. Then we decided to reveal the joke that this was all for the civil war that we're setting up. And we did like we did actually start to like we dropped some hints in the ridiculousness. For the first couple of days, we were pretty realistic in our arguments going back and forth. And then we oh, yeah. started doing like then we started doing a, a couple more insulting things that were like kind yeah, of outrageous. Th things got gradually more outrageous and ridiculous. That was the, the whole point on. was like if you were like if you were convinced that it was a prank, slowly you would realize it's <laughs> going to be outrageous. Like we just started doing stuff like we would like each other's posts that were like supposedly arguing against each other, you know, just to leave a couple hints or there. Yeah. We also started having Marvel puns in our posts. Like, yeah. We started, yeah. Like no, I don't know. I don't think you can call it Marvel puns. We just started like making references to Marvel we, quotes. We, there were like we quotes, quotes in, in our trailer. Post. Yeah. And some people picked up on it. Other people, it just went right over their head. Right. Um, 
But e even some people that were familiar with the lines didn't quite pick up on it, too. I remember uh, after the reveal, some people were like, oh, wow, I can't believe I missed all of those uh, those references in those posts. I, I do remember one post by a guy when I was just like, we, we we quoted the trailer at the very end, and I was like, you've just started the war. And this other guy, I forget, I forget his name, but he was like, I just yelled, yes, really loud, and my fa I woke my family up, and I don't care. <laughs> I think that was Maple. Was, was it Maple? It might have been. I, I don't think wanna... it was someone else. But <laughs> yeah, I remember been. seeing that post. That made me laugh. You know who really made me post. laugh in that in that um that thread was Looch. Oh my god! Yeah, that guy posted Luch, man. so you, many. You were making Luch, me laugh. Luch, Luch. All your Metal <laughs> you Gear see, references and the Metal Gear <laughs> stuff. Well, well, okay, Looch had like. He had an up and down for me, if I'm being honest. No, no. But, you know what? Loosh, he, he really won me over. Is it Loosh or Luke? Or dude, like I, Luke? I, it's, oh, it's, man, but I think Loosh I thought it was, was Loosh. I want to say Loosh. <laughs> yeah. It's Loosh because his name is derived from Lelouch from an anime called uh, Code Geass. Code Geass? Yeah, but yeah. Loosh yeah. sounds yeah. so much better. Because it, it is no, Loosh. Is. It's like, but, hey, yo, that's my man, yeah. Loosh. See, but but he he really won me over because a lot of his kind of meme stuff was referencing an anime that Meso and I really like. Uh, oh my gosh! T Tengen Topen Gurren Gurren Lagann. Uh, and I yeah, represent uh, Tengen yeah. Topen okay, no, Gurren okay, okay, It's better. What? It's, better it's, it's better than uh, it's better than One Piece. I've, I, oh, I feel like One what? Piece. I've watched One Piece and it was all right. It was so, you know so first I watched of all, a couple episodes. You, I, you, it was all right. You didn't watch enough of One Piece. And second of all, that's not the topic. But I really like the boss. He, he did. Yeah. And yeah. to like give some context for those pictures too. Uh, after the Civil War, that the real fun started after we revealed the joke, and right. it was like you just started a war. Everything was really ridiculous because then we flipped the switch and we changed our avatars to uh, Marvel characters. Mm -hmm. And then we changed our names. I was Black Panvar. I was Cap um, I was Captain Cap Captain J. That was yeah, Purple so Witch. I was Nat Guy. <laughs> I was Spider. Yeah, so that was a lot of fun, and that—that's when it really kicked off, because right. that's when everybody realized, okay, this is a joke. Let's play now. And just for the next like four or three days, we just like went back and forth yeah, in this like ridiculous around. fight. Uh, so yeah, there was mods. a lot of references and stuff. I think uh, for me, the most fun of that was like that first day or so after we really and we were going back and forth and we were responding in character with gifts and everything. That was like the most fun. And then, like, the second day, it's still too... But, like, around the second day... The second day, day you day, weren't even around, dude. No, well, yeah, listen. I was, I was around <laughs> for, like, a couple... Everyone was making fun uh, of you. The They're like, Team LJ wins. <laughs> yeah, Kahi, you got shredded in all three topics. All right, listen. I'm going... I'm going... Here's, here's, here's what happened. <laughs> Number one... It's like we started the war. Kahi abandons his team. It's just where I like I was oh for for all of Thursday. I was like the only active person on Team Kahi. Yeah, some of my that's thing, why T some of Team Kahi thing sucks. that happened. If not, that, if not my favorite moment in the entire threads with Kahi's face superimposed over the multicolored background with like started a war, abandons the war. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, I gotta say I hated those faces. Okay, I I, I love what? that you're really? saying that yeah. bar. Because yeah. this entire argument was started over me having to show my face, and it, then it is ironic. Yeah. It's really ironic. No, listen, I accept that because I accept that's part of being a thing. The thing that I got, like the thing about the, is not so much that like my face was used and stuff. Is that it got so lazy and there were so many of them at the end <laughs> where it was literally just like I don't know an equivalent term that doesn't use a swear word but it was just like spam just a bunch of spam at oh the end. it got it turned uh. into a lot of spam by the end of it there was so much spam it was just nothing and, and, but just like and, irrelevant point, we had to start deleting posts right too. and I, at that point too okay so we're, I mean, there's there's stuff like <laughs> near the end there was like one i was i had i had a full work day on a 13 hour work day oh here on, comes like, the excuses this entire thing <laughs> listen i'm just saying i'm not you're right. I wasn't here for the thing, but I I can't call off work because I want to make memes on a fake internet on the, on the internet, like a fake argument on the internet. That's on not gonna work on internet. a fake internet. <laughs> <laughs> it's not gonna be like it's not a thing where I can be like, oh yeah, sorry guys, I'm just gonna go, you know, yeah, see, do this it's for like a couple I hours. I sympathize with you, Kahi, but at the same time, you just got toasted by everyone that time. So it shredding. was. It was. The it, I mean, like hilarious at first. <laughs> it was really you were funny, just... like in its prime before it got kind of burnt out. <laughs> no, it, it well, see the thing is that the thing is once this thing happened, 
Like once people started just doing all these memes, it got <laughs> lazier and lazier to the point where at one point, literally, it was just people were writing words in MS Paint and sending them to each other. That was it. See, there, there was yeah, that that weird. Like the, there, those are so unnecessary too. There were two people setting up a freaking Minecraft server on the topic. They were like, "Hey, you want to play Minecraft?" The other guy's like, "Yeah." And they were like, yeah. they were like talking about like what server they're going to join. It I turned, had to delete yeah. those posts. I it. So I it, was, every it, turned, it. it turned and I, I got to the point too where we couldn't. We like I tried going back in and trying doing some stuff, and it was just every post I made, there'd be like six posts immediately after that. <laughs> Which are just yeah. filled, with, and it's just man. like, all right, you start listen, a war, that's not... and like you open the floodgates, rules at the window, chaos breaks out. Okay, Teams yeah, see that, that, I, I thought that was fun. I didn't mind that. I, I, yeah, listen, I mean, at the at the end of the day, it was supposed to be a fun thing, so I'm glad people had fun doing it. I yeah, said that, like, at, but, but I'm explaining like at the end where like, oh, why did why is TTV not as active now as they were beforehand? It's because it became impossible to keep up with that many posts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. it's true. Kind of so we also so, just kind of. I just got like kind of bored after a while. Like at yeah, first after it was while, really it was, fun. Like, after okay, a while, people but, like, stopped being witty about so, it too. It was just kind of like, yeah. a, like I liked interacting with like the mods and like you guys. Well, but like after a while, you all disappeared, and it's like, oh, here's my fine. thing. This is what I like. This is why I hated the face memes the most because <laughs> the the most fun that I had in that topic was when we were all <laughs> in character, in character right. as Civil War comic characters, uh, yeah. and we were in character and we were like bantering back and forth. But the insults were always derivative of the characters we were representing. Right. That was when it was funny. That's when it was funny. That's when it was fun when people were posting gifs of their character, like fighting or doing something cool in yeah. reference to another post. That right, kind right, of thing. I, like mess a weird insult must be like, oh yeah, you betrayed your team last time. What are you gonna do this movie? <laughs> like see that Yeah, or or like or like pur or purple was purple witch, he was Scarlet Witch. I would I would be like, oh well it's a shame you don't have a brother anymore or something oh, like that. Right, right. <laughs> Speaking of Quicksilver, yeah. my favorite exchange is actually with a fan called Quick Winter, who changed his name to like Quicksilver themed, and he was like bantering with me because I was Hawkeye, and he like posted a gif of Quicksilver like knocking me down, going like you didn't see that coming. So then I posted the gif of Quicksilver saying you didn't see that coming, and then dropping dead. <laughs> 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 yeah, see, that's see, funny. That, that's yeah, when that it was, was really great. fun. That was that was, and see, that was a great moment. Dude, going Meso, back and forth. Yeah, and, so and, on and a lot of with the oh you were all on point. Yeah, there is some like some great. Jeremy Renner gifts that you had. I, that I, was I, great. All the credit goes to Jeremy Renner for being great jiffable. Yeah, <laughs> yeah my favorite, my Party favorite, my favorite post moments. you made. My favorite post you made, Meso, was when uh, Kahi took over the boards on uh, was that Thursday or Wednesday? I can't remember. It, it was Thursday. Thursday, yeah. Kahi took over the boards and we reskinned the entire boards to be Kahi themed. <coughs> on that on that day, we were like, okay, Team Kahi's won, and then someone was like. That's okay. We could team LJ can still do this, right? We still got this. And then Messa replied saying, "It was like this big uplifting quote, like don't give up. We've got this. We'll keep fighting." And then there was the post of Jeremy Renner saying, like just internally completely screaming. destroyed, internally screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny. It was hilarious. Yeah. See, there were, there that were the was, moments that stood out for me later yeah, that, on. Yeah, those were the moments where I was having fun. What? I didn't like the meme thing because I feel like every time. Some people took the topic a bit too seriously, and it, it went from making fun of the, the Civil War characters to just making fun of us, the cast right. members. Mm -hmm. And that got a little old. That got old very, very fast. Especially since people... a lot of people decided to just jump on this bandwagon. And like, and they, right. And like, yeah. they, nobody was being creative about it. No one's being, it, it was just like, oh, yes, you know, you guys suck. You guys win. It, yeah. It just that, that got like really boring. It just yeah. of spam. Well, it's like, this is the kind of thing. Some people were like, I didn't find the joke funny. And I'm like, that's perfectly fine. Your humor is a difficult thing. You can't please everybody all the time. Your mileage may vary when it comes to comedy. And, like, this is a great example of that. No matter what you do, certain people have certain comedic preferences. And, that like, you just got to try your best for the yeah. joke. I, I like, got to say, like the memes. What, you know, what, one of my favorite okay. things, one of my favorite things that happened in this is, see, I, I set a lot of this up with the mods, too. Because I had them interact and kind of play along, our moderators. By the way, yeah, shout out guys, to all the mods. They yeah, shout good. out to our moderators, um, sp specifically. Oh, speaking of the mods, yeah, well, uh, well, all like the mods and Zeros were all in on the well, joke right, from the right. very yeah, beginning. Yeah, and we'll get into that in just a moment. But right, mods, you guys did a great job. This was really mods funny. Did a great job. And Real good. chronicler, and I had, indie, John <laughs> Smith, Lego Master, political slime, and Wash. You're cool. Yes. Now carry on. Don't yeah. Forget yeah, for all me. the people that watch the trailer who, and have no clue who yeah. uh, who uh, yeah. why, the doctor why is, is the or why he's there. Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like yeah. Why is Doctor Who have a robotic arm? 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, but, but no, here's the really great thing, though. See, I had it set up so that political slime would be the kind of the third party. He was Crossbones, and he set up Team Anarchy. And we had a lot of different teams that got set up. Team Purple, which I wanted to annex Purple for my team for. We had Team, nu- <laughs> team Nuclear, Team Kahi, Team LJ, obviously. And then we had Team Anarchy. And in true anarchist fashion, as soon as it formed, it fell to pieces. <laughs> I, I love that. I was like, that's how anarchy works. It completely it's like there's no apart. leaders. There's no leaders. <laughs> it, it, was, it was the funniest thing. <laughs> it just crumbled. Yep. I think the the remnants of them, some of them went to Team Kai, some of them started Team Nuclear. Yeah, some of them started Team Nuclear, and it kind of confused me at first, because I was thinking, is that like an offshoot? Okay, so like, they they supported Team LJ, because, you know, radiation, Team Nuclear, that kind of thing. Wow. But but it was really kind of funny. And then there were were some of those people. What do you have to do with radiation? Yeah, I don't get it. I don't don't get get it. it either. I'm sensitive to radiation. They're they're cash. Wait, so wouldn't that be against against you? Yeah, yeah that, that means they're against you. Okay? Yeah. I swear they supported me. Well, <laughs> I'm not, they e- might have supported e- you. Even I'm if they did. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, yeah. even if they did, I, I like, what you just I, said was stupid. I, I, I get it. The, the analogy doesn't work, but that's that's the reasoning. But, um. So you're saying but that is it? Stupid. It doesn't is make sense, though. There's you no make that up. I get it. I get it. I'm an idiot, but that's my reason. No, <laughs> <laughs> okay, Wait, I get it. So, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Here's, but, here's the thing with my team. Team. Zach Snyder, 2016. My team, while, while on Team <laughs> Kahi, sense, like the leader was gone and everyone else had to kind of make up for that. On my team, I was around and everyone on my team hated me for some reason. Purple. <laughs> I swear, you ticked me off so much. You wanted to start this dumb Team Purple thing. And okay, it just... first of all, in my defense, I was not expecting people to actually go along with that. You don't understand the power oh, you I just have. Made, I just made up, like, a little joke, like, oh, LOL, Team Purple, woohoo. And people actually went with it. It was like, <laughs> oh, crap. LOL, I don't know what you team, get off my team. And then you kept it up. I made, like, you, one you dash, kept, okay? Nah, I couldn't no, even get it. Kept you kept it up a lot. You kept it up a lot. No, you had at least that. 10 you, Team you Purple. Yeah, you, you were, like, Team Purple all the way. and you kept Team yeah. Purple actually lived all the way up to the end. They were yeah, like you kept Ops trying to milk that <laughs> cow <laughs> as much as possible until it had nothing more to I'm pretty sure offer. most of Team Purple just wanted free art. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's all they wanted. They're they were hoping just you're, there. Make you, like, they, you'd make them avatars or something. But but the oh, other no. thing is, Meso, I swear, you were so Yo. against me the entire time. <laughs> well, listen, it's like, realistically, like if we're having this debate... Re- realistically, the ethics, you're a jerk. Ethics in bionicle journalism. <laughs> like, <laughs> you are you're so... Using, <laughs> you're using, you're back. taking off your mask. It's like, I would tend to lean more to the side of and just take off the mask. This this, this so, all goes all the way back reveal. to that old conversation we have. How, how you're so two-faced. <laughs> okay, oh, this was man. an example where, yes, I was two-faced. Yeah. There we go. I supported you, I believed in what you were doing, but I could also kind of see the other side, so I would slip in, like, yeah, yeah, insults yeah, 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 yeah. in there. Uh-huh, sure. But no, my favorite part was Team Anarchy, how it just formed and <laughs> that, was, that was pretty that funny. Was it, formed right? and crumbled. They just yeah. dissolved. Yeah. It was a lot of fun. That was it was it was really hard to keep up with it because like there were just post after post. After post I think but, there's yeah. about five thousand posts I have not looked at. I just was like, I'm oh just gonna goodness. get to the bottom. I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling. Yeah, the way I mean, like you, you total topics and a total of roughly uh, almost ten thousand posts. If we didn't like, actually wow. hit ten thousand, oh if if you looked away for like thirty minutes for yeah. say like you had to go to the bathroom and then eat something, I don't know. You went somewhere, came back. You had 500 more messages you needed to read yeah. to keep up I woke with up. I woke up to 700 new messages. It was just like, um, oh, yeah. yeah oh, no, I'm yeah, so sorry that. for all the people that had to go to bed. <laughs> I was like, oh, I had, like, I left for work for eight. I came back after eight hours at work. I was like, no, it was, there's 2,000 new posts and a new topic. <laughs> <laughs> That was it, yeah. was it was crazy. And Our data bill for this month is going to be insane it's with all the be. GIFs. And- okay. Let's let's talk a bit for a second about all the idiots on the topic who are like, why are the boards going so slow? It keeps glitching. Kahi, fix it. Yeah, it's like and take then, a and wild then, guess. You have and like I would post in gifts and images gifts. on your <laughs> topic. 
Why do you think the boards are glitching up and going slow? You've <laughs> uploaded 50 gigabytes of images in 24 hours! And not only that, like, it has to render that all on one page. That's why it's taking so freaking long to load. It's because it's like, oh wow, there's like pretty much 400 megabytes of stuff I need to load. That's just been posted since that post. It's also why we uh, had to make like so many new topics just to keep it running smoothly. <laughs> right. We ended up having uh, I think three, four parts actually. It, it was four, a lot. four different. Yeah, four different topics to continue the discussion. All that reached like two thousand or three thousand posts per topic. So yeah. it was a crazy lot of uh, stuff, a lot of craziness. Man. <sighs> yeah. So, okay. Yeah, it, it was interesting, but people, I get people just like to complain, man. It's it was funny. Yeah. Just, uh, just, yeah. Oh, and then, like, the let's, people let's talk about people. Let's, let's talk about people complaining. You want to talk about people complaining? Let's talk about the, the new skin. The red. Can we talk about, about the red? Talk about the red? I want to talk about yeah. the red. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that that was red. stupid. What's the, what oh the, my god. I think either everybody is either colorblind or need to have their monitors checked for <laughs> color correction. The red guys, tell me what happened. Okay, listen. I completely understand having a preference to something a different color than red that makes sense to me and i understand okay we changed the boards to a red right. color scheme that you don't like it cool right. totally cool. get that what i don't get was all the people that went on and on and on about how the red was burning their eyes or searing it's or being too red. painful like, like what how bright is your screen <laughs> I have move no your face idea. away from the monitor there is no way that color was searing your eyes. Get over yeah. it. Yeah. Well, and then, I mean, red but, but is a then, pretty bright color. Then but... the, Shut up. The best thing <laughs> possible up. happened. The best thing possible happened, though, because you went to go darken it some more. And the boards. <laughs> right, yeah, people were complaining so much about it. Yeah, well, see, the thing that the thing is, we had or I had already preset up the skins right. for uh, when we were ready to change them. So when it was time to make the Kahi skin, the, the the important one, that was already made, that was ready to go. So I was able to just flip the switch, and that you know, that that uh that changed. But people, there were so many people complaining about the uh, the red being too bright that I was like, all right, fine, I'll 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 darken it. So I go to darken it, and I mean to do that, I have to like edit the, the current skin that the boards are using. So for like uh for like a couple minutes. Literally two minutes, not even two minutes. It didn't even reach the two minute mark. It was at one minute and like 40 seconds because I counted to make sure it wasn't too long because I didn't want anyone complaining. Lo and behold, it didn't stop anyone. <laughs> they still complained. Um, so whole minutes far. Shut up. So because so many people are changing, I changed the color to a darker red. The boards went transparent for like a minute and 40 seconds so that that change could go live. <laughs> I go back to the topic. There's like freaking 300 posts about people saying, You broke the site! What are you doing? Why would you do this? But Team see, Kahi sucks! My, my favorite part <laughs> Jeez, about that is... Stop the, complaining! My, my favorite you, part about that... You are the, at fault! This is your fault! It, see, the best thing about that is that they blamed Team Kahi for it. <laughs> Yeah. Well, okay, listen, do you know why? It's because, like, all the people that are doing this stuff, all the people that are complaining, all the people that are spamming our boards with these huge gifts, they're all your fans. So, okay, yeah. I, can we talk I'm, about, like, the teams for a second? Because I yeah, thought it was really like, interesting how that went down. It's like, Team Kahi, it was Team Kahi versus Team LJ. And, like, yeah. all throughout, Team Kahi constantly, they, like, all the important moment moments that happened during this event were, like, all Team Kahi. Like, Team Kahi initiates the war... <laughs> And they start that, then Team Kahi takes over the boards, and that was that, and then Eldrick, spoiler alert, gets murdered by political slime. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> literally, <laughs> there was, the there was never wins. a point in the actual war where LJ ever had the upper hand ever. Except, yes. well, well here, here's the thing. Except, there, there was, in sheer quantity. Yeah, okay. Yes. So there was one like, day, there was one day before oh, that was the that takeover. Was where all, all, Team LJ just flooded the topic, and Team Kai was nowhere to be found. Well, that's what like I mean. Var, like, like Var, you were important... kind of there, and then Kai, you weren't there at all. And then Van, you well, switched I mean, sure, over sure, sure. to Team LJ. <laughs> that, well, that's kind of the point I was getting at. It was like all the moments that happened during the war were all Team Kai oriented, but Team LJ was perceived to have the upper hand almost constantly because they like just outnumbered them in such large right. quantities. Yeah. And like they were so overwhelming, they gave the illusion. Yeah, see, that here, they were here's winning. the thing. Here's the thing that didn't get to that that, that makes right. sense to me is that Team Kahi literally did nothing for two days except post stupid pictures that had 
Team no LJ. relevance. Yeah. Or yeah, team team LJ. Sorry. Nice job, Vark. <laughs> stupid stupid pictures that had no relevance at all. <laughs> funny pictures. Bar- barely barely funny. Barely. I like them. <laughs> A lot of them are cringeworthy. Let's be real. Yeah, oh, you don't like all of them. You no, like, like you like, like you like the best them. ones. And there's some cruising great ones. Like this one is a copy yeah. past the poo. Love that. That's so funny. <laughs> I mean, the think Paul, I the cut Paul up my mouth like ones. I'm constipated. It's the, hilarious. Oh, dude, 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 the one where it's me and you, Kahi, oh, we're like photo- our our faces are photoshopped with Batman and Robin <laughs> running to the camera, and then there's Ca- Captain America in the background <laughs> throwing a shield. Yeah, that was hilarious. Yeah, but like so many others are just like you put your face on top of like I don't know. Like the and Reaper X- from Mass Effect or something. I was, yeah. it's just some of my favorite people. Obviously, we already mentioned Lush. He did good stuff. We uh, did some good stuff. NC zero one three five four. I laughed at a lot of his stuff. And then uh, Swagmeister, who actually came in. Oh my late. gosh! Okay, Swagmeister, Swagmeister had one of the best retorts to Slime. Oh, I, I, oh, I, yeah. I, yeah. So, yeah. Slime yeah, was saying, oh, is that the baby one? Yeah, the baby yeah, baby yeah. yeah. Slime yes. I think Slime was saying to someone, I don't remember who, um, like, hey, stop, uh, go ahead and, and suck on a baby bottle. No, it, it was about you. It was like how you were just a baby and now you needed a baby bottle or something. Yeah. And, and, and then Swagmeister was like, well, I guess you can borrow yours. Oh, <laughs> that was a pretty like, sick burn. See, there, there were a lot of good burns. And for, yeah. for like one day, Team LJ was doing really good of just shredding Ka- yeah. like Kagi's team. There was like that that day that Kagi wasn't there and it was only me participating. We were getting wrecked. Yeah, and That then, was the day I could definitely give to Team LJ. Out. Then your internet went. Oh, out, that right? well, see, that annoyed that annoyed me because the one day I was actually free to actively contribute, my internet did go out, so I wasn't able to really do anything, yeah. and that was annoying. So I had to go on mobile and maybe participate every now and then. But uh, but yeah, it's like for the most part though, Team LJ was nothing but a bunch of memes, and that was it. There was never any like wrecks, no uh, no great comebacks, no awesome jokes or well, sick I don't know, burns. Man. I mean, I think my jokes are pretty great. You know what? Yeah, <laughs> it was like it was just by sheer volume. And there, the people are like, no, we're still, we're still in this. Even though no, LJ actually right. did nothing. LJ, if you look at what happens with LJ, LJ sh- starts an argument, then it turns into a war, then he dies. Right. Okay. <laughs> that's, yeah, it. Th- die. that's the thing. That's the thing. Like we, Team Kahi did all the important things. Team LJ did nothing but post spam, nice. and then, <laughs> and then it's like, yeah. for some reason, everybody in Team LJ was still convinced they were winning the war. <laughs> Even, yeah, even after I died, mask. because see, here's what happened. So we set up the joke, we plan it out. I'm glad I switched uh, back I kick to start, Team Kai. I kickstart things by posting <laughs> like my my whole issue or what have you. Right, and then right, the war right. starts, and then kind of after the Kahi takeover, we slime is like LJ, come on, I have a great idea. I want to do something. Um, and I'm like, okay, great, all right, let's do this. And slime posts the thing where I die. And we oh, ki- we kind of intended that to be the end of things. Kai was going to post an eulogy, and he did. And we eulogy. thought, okay, well, that's the end of it. Eulogy. An eulogy. What you say? Eulogy. So so I die. Kai posts the thing. You happy now? Great eulogy, by the way. <laughs> yes. Love <laughs> it. It was really funny. And and instead of everyone going, oh well, that was that was a lot of fun. You know, I had a great time with that. They were like. We have to avenge LJ. <laughs> Onward for yep. Team LJ. Oh, yep. It was I mean, the complete that, opposite that response. All it they just they just they, they were so persistent. It's like <laughs> they just don't know when to quit, man. It's like they don't have bedtimes. <laughs> this is why children need bedtimes. I I, I wow. now like this th- this whole April Fool's joke has taught me one very important lesson. I now know why the current American election is how it is right now. I know it's no longer a mystery to me. For a while, I was like, "Way oh, to go, how political!" Is, how is our election? I'm, I'm not. I'm not listening to any names. It's a crazy election. No matter which side you're on, you're like, "This is crazy." I can't believe anything's happening well, in this election. There, there's another couple now of I'm comments no longer bagging inspired. on you for this. Listen, I'm no like th- honestly. It's like this is the. It's just you know. There's a lot of volume and a lot of the, you a have lot of a lot of volume supporting bro. one thing. Hey, Team LJ has a lot of volume, but hey, it was really guys. funny. And a lot of time. Going. Let's be real. I don't know what I don't know what your fans do all day, but like apparently it involves sitting in front of a computer and using. Dude, it's, a, it's the same thing we used to do all day back in the day. Listen, yeah. I think they 
They're perfectly fine. Obviously, things got a little bit uh, extreme in certain instances. We did have to suspend a, a few bit. people, but yeah, we, was, we, there, it, there's oh, some points where people know, crossed the line. Overall, it I think that it went very well. I think everyone involved had a really good well. time, and well, totally. yeah, I'm very happy with the end result. Went, can we, uh, can, we can we talk about the for me? Can we talk about the end result? Can we like? What end result? Uh, what, uh, like the oh, like what we're working the, on the, right the, now? I mean, like oh, the reskin. The, I, yeah, at the time of the at the time of this recording, we're, there's two things that came about that are going to be permanent changes. Uh, oh, well, now, one's not a change, but one's like an actual thing. Can we talk about that? Since by the time this is up, I'm assuming it'll be up. I right? mean, are you talking about the current status of the colors of the board? Yes, and the everything. I don't know what the other thing is. The current just... status of the colors of the other thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I I have no idea what you're talking about. Are, the lead the, in, the finale. Are you talking about? Are you that? talking about the thing relating to me? I'm lost. Yes. Uh, no, we're not going to talk you're about. Finally, that. making me a mod. But but let's go ahead and talk about the colors of the board because nobody likes it. <laughs> yeah, we're like we're getting live feedback as we're like, uh, actually like recording this, <laughs> and it's like <laughs> the the grand consensus is it's too bright. And so, like, I'm, I'm going to ask this on air because I don't know. And this is a good way to clarify for the masses. Can we have multiple skins that people select? Well, I don't know that right now, but uh, yeah. thank you for putting us on the spot. Well, hey, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's, like job, a, it's like a double-edged sword. We can, like, answer the question that will inevitably be asked, and I want to know. So it's I like, mean, hey. now, now you're going to go ask people. I mean, you, normally when you could ask that, I would be like, oh, sure, I'll go look that up for you and figure it out if we can do that or not. But right now... We're on air. Yeah, <laughs> trying to have I, a show. Well, yeah, we're not on, on air, but okay. Listen, we are quite <laughs> literally on air. We right are now. literally recording. We are floating right in the in the freaking sky. So yeah, shut cool. up. But I think personally, I think the board should be purple. But personally, I think you shouldn't <sighs> be on this recording. But I'm starting to agree. Team I think purple. Your face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So whatever. So, to to all the people that say it's too bright, I say there's a little button under your monitor, and it kind of looks, <laughs> you know, if you press the button a couple of times, two things are going to happen. It's either going to go up and become brighter, or it's going to go down and become darker. Make it go darker. Alger, that's too much work. Oh, yeah, sorry. Forgot. We're, we're in a new age. Okay, use your mouse button, go to control panel, and you'll find similar settings. No, but I mean, this is a, it is an important thing for us to get feedback on what we're doing, and I feel like that we designed the new boards to be in line with the new website and how the new website is done. I think the th only thing people are really saying is too bright is maybe the header, the the thing, the bar. That's that my thing. I like the background, but I do think the header could be a few shades I, darker. I don't think that it's an issue at all. The notifications. I don't think so. Fine to me. But I mean, you know what? We we might I don't know if we'll play around with it or not. That's not like a promise or anything. But we we'll, we will be We're listening to feedback, feedback going forward. Into yeah. Consideration. Uh, so. Honestly, it's already darker than our front page because it's using the secondary shade, not our primary. <laughs> oh, I, okay, sure. <laughs> it Listen, is uh -huh. just. Yeah, listen, I'm not. I'm saying that we are going to have a. We are listening to people. We're going to have a conversation about it. Um, I'm currently okay with how the boards look, but we're not the only people that of use our boards. Of course you are. So. No, I'm, it's not me I'm, anymore. I like we changed it. <laughs> you brought LJ. You brought it up. Was your intention to just say screw I don't, you fans? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know why we're talking about this on the podcast right now. <laughs> Why did you bring it up if you didn't want to say we're listening to your feedback? I, I mean, listen, we can listen to the feedback all they like. This, literally, it earlier on in this episode, you guys were saying that they were all dumb for saying that the red was too bright. <laughs> that could, I mean, sure, but that wasn't a permanent change. Yeah. That's, that's, that was for the full sake of a joke. Right. Th I mean, this is, like, this is the thing where we will actually... This is completely different. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we, no. my, my feedback is, it looks fine to me. Looks... Really yeah. great. Personally, I really <laughs> like how it has like you the heard it here. Team LJ hates the fans. The thinks your opinions are like, stupid. <laughs> 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 Hold on, dude, I'm like, I can't post all my memes on these blue boards. <laughs> 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 it's too bright. 
Bloat memes. <laughs> yeah, I feel you. I think Jeremy Renner played oh, next to Paul Blart. Oh boy. I loved it. That, loved it, we, that. This is probably, this is a really good prank though. This, I'm and like, we, we layered it really well, I feel. Like, where we had enough stuff happening at a certain point in time. And as much as, as much like grief as I give, like, all the, the, like, you know, the flood of stuff, it did help, like, fill in the gap from event to event to event like yeah. all the major events yeah. that we had here it was nice we f- there wasn't any points i feel like people that were participating in the event felt like oh well you know nothing's really happening this sucked it's like yeah. constantly there's something yeah I, yeah and, and, i mean as as frequent as it like as a constant stream as it was i still think it was a lot of fun interacting with people and oh yeah honestly it was probably the most fun and by fun i mean like just joy and right. actively wanting to go to the site and spend my time here just to interact that I've ever had in the board. It's probably the most I've ever most right. fun I've ever had. Yeah. And it's like uh, before I, I've always enjoyed going to the boards, mostly for serious discussion, that kind of thing, but I've never I can't say that it's fun to go Yeah, on in the, the sense boards, that you know? it's just you just goof off. Right. Right. It I was, don't go to the boards was, to goof off. It yeah. was honestly legitimately really fun during this week, and it was it, I, I, it would be great to do it again sometime. So yeah, oh, totally. no, I, I really had had a lot of fun. And like the culmination, like obviously we you, you spoke a little bit about slime's uh, video <clears throat> and how like you know, slime did the thing, and that was really great. Like don't get me wrong, <laughs> but the real highlight was Zeros. Uh, yes. So T T Vinjus. So what I did, we have to give a lot, a lot of credit to Zeros. And LG2 for spearheading this. Zeros. Yes. Yeah. So don't don't make it like correctly. there's a correct way to pronounce his name, okay? <laughs> don't get I, on I me. Man. Okay, Are I would love about it. The dude that made the animations for us or the printers? <laughs> <laughs> or the general, General so, Zeros. So, what if it's wow. like, I, say, Ross in the I would love it if he just came onto the comments of this video and was like, uh, there is a correct way to pronounce it. Thank you very much, Kai. No, and once once he says it, I'll follow. I'm saying that there's no way now you guys are getting on to me like, it's oh, Kahi, you're not saying so, the correct way. So anyway, anyway, so here's what happened. So we, when we were in the planning stages of, of this giant prank, I went to our moderators because we were going to involve them anyway, and I said, listen, so I'm going to have Zeros, who is a big member of our community, great big artist who works on a bunch of different things and is really stylized and is very distinct. And I'm going to have him make avatars for all of us, you know, uh, as characters from Civil War. <laughs> so I'm going to need descriptions of what your characters are. I'm going to send them to him. Well, that was not what ended up happening. What I instead did was had Purple make them, and they're fantastic. They look great. Great work. Thank you. I love them they so are much. very, very good. Uh, I don't want to get rid of mine. <laughs> yeah, I, I really want to keep mine, if I'm being I honest. I think I'm going to okay. keep that guy for a little bit. I, I got to switch back to my old one. But, oh, so, you don't so like what, using my art as your avatar? No, it's a personal stain on my record. But anyway, <laughs> so what I went ahead and did <laughs> is, like is I contacted Zeros. Anyway. I... <laughs> Listen, pal. I contacted Zeros and <laughs> his record smells like LJ. <laughs> it uses LJ cologne. So I contacted I Zeros and he does he does animations as well on his channel. And we linked it in the Civil War trailer video. But I said, "Hey, I really want to do this. We're going to do this huge pl- prank. Would you be interested?" And he said, "Yeah, absolutely." And he did such a phenomenal job working with him was spectacular. He was super mm. polite mm. and courteous, and he kept us updated absolutely all the time. And we worked on it, worked on it, and went back and forth. But I didn't tell anyone here that that's what I had done until like a few days before it was finished. And yeah. I was like, hey, guys. Great reveal. Look at this. And everyone was like, what? So this we got the crazy. trailer. Yeah, he did a phenomenal job. He made the trailer. We got it done. And then it went to Var and Ven to work yeah. on new music and sound oh, effects. Yeah. And the two of them did Yee, a phenomenal high five, job. Ben. Yeah, you, man, you guys also amazing. did a really good job. Yeah. And then we, we, Kahi and I, we worked on the script and we redubbed it <coughs> to give it completely a different feel. Uh, okay, I want to I wanna, I wanna get this out there because I'm like, I'm re- <laughs> oh, yeah, here, here we go. go. I'm so done. Here we go. I'm so, I'm so done when I heard this. I was like, <laughs> The, the lines, some of the lines that Ben chose for this trailer, 
he took from the worst <laughs> take that I did out of all these lines because he thought it would be ironic because I'm complaining about LJ's audio quality and he wanted like it would be, it would be ironic if all this your this audio stuff. quality is poor he literally <laughs> chose the worst take I was so mad when I heard it I was like you son of a it was so funny, dude. For like the first like couple hours after that video was out, I just could not stop from laughing any time that that scene was mentioned. <laughs> so poor. just the pure thought of it just made me laugh so much. <laughs> it was uh, oh, see, yeah. and that was the goal. <laughs> see, I do feel like that's a thing that we would probably enjoy more in the community. The thing is that like you you guys find it funny, and I agree because it's like it's funny. In this context of you making this video, you know this joke. Other people who are coming to this video are just like, oh, that was a, that was a bad line. That's it. They don't think it's funny. Or it's like, oh, it's pretty bad. I don't know, man. I think you people find will irony catch on when they hear you talking about audio quality. No, I, I'm saying that they'll think that's done on purpose. Like, oh, that was just, you know, it's like, oh, man, TTV is really bad. That's just hypocritical. As opposed to like, oh, that wall, that's a joke because I think Ben just chose the worst one. I it. I think that you overthought it as part of the joke, and that's why the jokes are going to sell. I didn't really put much, much thought into it, actually. I was just like, hey, this will be funny. Uh, it in there. Thought. You're giving me too much credit. Uh, either way, now get I over think yourself. that everyone involved did a really great job. The trailer went out. Everyone loves it. Xeros did a phenomenal job. Working with him was really great. I was rewatching it a second ago, and I loved like the final, uh, final shot before the title card of like all the TT Vinjus rushing towards each other. Kai's giant. <laughs> well, it's, it's, a, it's a he's twice as thing. he's. I know it's just funny to me, like Mega Kai. <laughs> <laughs> he's twice as big as Wash Falcon Falcon Knight. <laughs> I. It's pretty great. I nicknamed the new boards the Mark IV after like because we had we had one version of the boards and then we had a new version that was like oh, it had a, a, little, a lot of different like the flat design stuff and like also the uh, the the new hot topics and that was like Mark II and then like the the Kahi one was like the the Mask Buster is what I called it and then like now we yeah have the, yeah the, Mark the IV. Mask Buster oh. that's funny yeah that's lame but <laughs> <laughs> shut up purple man what. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give, leave you some mean comments on me, Tomo. You, wow, I really, you I really liked your snark purple thread. All of that, you had some really good quips. Like in the Thank initial you. argument when we were like laying the groundwork. You were, like, no, yeah. You know, to be marks. honest, I feel kind of bad for that. Like I got way more into that than I should have. You, you got. I, I I'm, real, I'm you honestly so very sorry. Much. I was, I was like. Purple's kind of a. Purple's like I was like, yeah, I, was, I, was, I had a moment. I was like, too is Purple actually this. kind of a jerk? Yeah, I was like, I I think she might I actually be hilarious. a terrible yeah. person. Yeah. And, and hey man, you guys insult me all the time. I was just returning the favor. A any of <laughs> any of the great moments you had completely went out the window because of Team Purple, you punk. <laughs> it's yeah, just yeah, like, nope, yeah. I'm done. You're done. We're done. Everything's done. Well, now everything really is done because we're nearing the end of this episode. Hey. Hey. Wow. Nice. Yep. You're on Team Thanks. Purple? Uh, Not nice. It was a very, 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 very fantastic joke. And, like, a lot of people, I can't address this earlier, a lot of people were like, you know, you, you had such a massive lead in and you went so in depth with it. And some people may not necessarily get all of the, uh, all the jokes and all the references if they don't frequent the message boards. And that's certainly a valid thing. Like, if you're only a YouTube follower of us, you may not have understood everything completely in the trailer. But, like, we wanted to do something that really encompassed pretty much everything we do currently. We wanted to have, like, message boards tie-ins and channel tie-ins that work together and were tied into something that we were all interested in. Like, Marvel Civil War comes out pretty soon. And it was really, it was a massive undertaking. I know a lot of people were like, why, why didn't you just do this on April 1st. Why did you, some, some people saw the teaser video we had up on Vessel for the trailer. They're like, why'd you put that up on Vessel? It's like, well, because we have this thing on Vessel, we have to release our videos seven days in advance. And like, we have to work around our constraints. And oh, that actually got a little annoying because there were some people that went out and found the link to the trailer before it was ready to be yeah. released. And like they the were teaser. posting about it in the topic. Yeah, the teaser. Um, But like, I, they they were accessing a video that they weren't supposed to have access to, so they were getting the pop up that says uh, this is vessel early access only, or you need to have you need to be a vessel subscriber to watch it. And it was really annoying because that kind of started this like brief 
uh, session of people just complaining on the topic about how we're like we've hid the April Fool's joke behind a paywall. Which we weren't it, even done. Like, see, yeah, yeah. Which, it, which, yeah, which was really annoying because it wasn't even ready to go out yet. Yeah, it's like you, you, I don't think they they really get the concept. It just, I don't, I don't think so either. It's because we we put up the like the the, the quote unquote teaser, which was just a thirty second blurry video seven weeks earlier, just so that when the time came, we could make it live for everybody. So it was it was anno- it was really frustrating when you go through the effort to make sure there's that loophole so that everybody can see it. And then they twist that in a way right. that it kind of puts the blame back on us for trying to do something to avoid that whole situation entirely. Yeah, like, there were a lot of moving pieces to this event, and we were doing our best to work through them and, like, put out an entertaining product. And, like, it was tough, man. Yeah, see, we man, have We have I... reasons for what we do. That's, like, the kind of the moral of the story. We, yeah. <laughs> there is logic there. Yeah. And people should not jump to conclusions. I think that's a general rule of thumb that you should have when you're on the internet. Yeah. But I think at the you end of the like... day, when I when I thought, okay, what are we going to do for April Fool's? Because a lot of people last time were saying, how are they going to top this, TTE, and what have you? Well, Easily. the goal... The, thanks. The goal you was... top to, it with hot fudge. <laughs> I swear. The goal... <laughs> the goal <laughs> was for everyone to have fun. And everyone to just enjoy the And boy, the it's day. so much better than TTE. It's yeah, way better. Because right, well, it actually involves everybody. It's not just, right, yeah, not just LJ. Yeah, not well, just LJ. I mean, elder. normally you guys don't care about April Fool's jokes, and it took me a lot of convincing to get you guys interested in this idea. Mm-hmm. But yeah, um, you're not, you're not wrong there. No one, no one was on board. No, you're right. Because, like, normally April Fool's jokes are, like, they're not. They don't involve all of this. So whenever we hear April Fool's, it's like, oh, and, and that was like, like oh, that funny last year, another LJ. That idea. was what right. I. <laughs> but you know, this, this I really is how you wanted. Do it. I really wanted that this year for everyone to be involved and for everyone to have fun because a lot of the time on April Fools, you're gonna find a lot of pranks and jokes that are just gonna be infuriating or offensive. Just not not because they actively offend, but because they're just so infuriating, you feel angry about it. I didn't want that to be the case this time. I want everyone to enjoy it and have fun and be involved in yeah. the community. See, a lot of the thing, a lot of April Fool's jokes is that they make you think you're going to be getting one thing, and in the end, it's just a yeah, joke and then they and just take it away it. from you. And that, right, right. That can get really irritating. But with this, so it's like we we kind of did that with the trailer, but like there was a literally a week of build up to try and like prepare. make it obvious. Okay, this isn't. It's not just. What it's gonna be, and then also there's a lot of things to have fun with as well and interact. Right. So. And, and the thing, the thing it, I feel it works is that like, in the beginning, nobody wants what's being set up. Nobody wants to have all of us argue in the public eye about like something. Right. And so right. w- when it's revealed to be a joke, it's less like oh, okay, whew, they weren't going there. They're actually doing this fun thing instead. And it's also I feel it, it works because it's not just oh well we we're just joking. We actually have a payoff to it, and that's like really cool stuff. Like, we have, like, right. different points where things change. We have different points. It led up to the trailer, which was really cool. And also Simon's video, which is also really funny. So, I feel yeah. like the payoff works because of all those things coming together. We actually have something to deliver at the end of it. If it was just our, mm-hmm. us arguing and then, lol, it's just a prank, bro. I feel like it wouldn't have been... The, it would, the that, reception that would have been have worked out. Yeah, yeah. that would have been That was kind of my thing. It was, like, you had to put the moving parts together into the hole to get the true... Part of the joke. joke, and that's why it was it was difficult to do it. I'm glad we did it. Yeah, yeah and I doubt. I don't honestly think you're ever gonna see us doing an April Fool's joke where we're like actively out to deceive you guys, and then at the very end, it's like, ha ha, you're all suckers. We did not go into this intending for everyone to be completely duped. We thought it was pretty obvious, honestly. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> Let's not shy into the shadows the whole thing you guys do. Remember that, yeah. guys? <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I'm not good <laughs> with being angry. Can I go to bed now? Nope. Yeah, I'm Please. tired, man. It's like... You're a tired oh. man? Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> Shut up, <Wow>. Dad. <laughs> man, purple, go back to Team Purple. <laughs> I don't want to. It's boring. Nothing happens. Well, gee. Oh, I wonder why. 
Oh, All right, well, uh, if anyone was hoping for Bionicle news, it's April. <laughs> train. <Hype> train. <laughs> I like, I like how the second you mentioned Bionicle news, the hype train comes in. And that has train. been our Bionicle. That's. And that's been our Bionicle <laughs> news, everyone. I hope you really enjoyed hearing about that really revolutionary stuff. This month Pretty we cool. do have yeah. a graphic novel too. That is yeah, a thing. That, that's what I was gonna say. Uh, it's, since it's April now, this month on the twenty sixth, we are going to get the second graphic novel. So. Pre-order it, and you maybe you'll get it early, like me. Okay. Well, okay, unless anyone has anything else, I suppose that will be the end of TTV 189. Can I be a mod now? No. Okay. No. no. Why? Mm. What do I gotta do the, to earn it? Not say anything ever. Oh, but how would I be a cast member then? You sit on your ass. You want. wouldn't be. So thank you all very much for listening to the latest episode of the TTV podcast. Hope you enjoyed a joke. If you didn't, well, tough hope you beans. didn't even know about it. There's like a bunch of posts you can go read through. <laughs> and find some enjoyment don't, there. Don't do it. <laughs> do it. It's great. Yeah, Just read I recommend like the modern staff posts. I, the, yeah, I recommend reading ones. it soon if you want to catch everybody with their avatars and stuff. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm going to change mine like right after this. Yeah, I'm, I'm switching mine right now. Wow, wow you guys are, you guys are like stupid. Mine. I'm going to keep it. So, thanks very much for listening. Check us out on Vessel at Vessel.com forward slash the TTV channel for one week early access to all of our content. Only $3 a month helps a ton. And, you know, you can always buy a shirt at store.ttvpodcast.com. This shirt of April will soon be up for sale, hopefully. Yeah, and we will soon Ryan, open the... Please. Yeah, it's too I have late. to win. It's too late, point. Purple Knack and Jay is gonna be the shirt. Yep. And listen, uh, but even even if you don't feel like paying the three dollars a month or the nineteen ninety nine a year, Vessel is you can still use Vessel completely free, and it still helps us out a ton. You can watch all the videos the same time they come out on YouTube, but just on Vessel's platform, and your view counts so much more towards all of our videos than it would on YouTube. Mm -hmm. It it would be a great service to us and help us keep making videos. Yep. So. so. All right, that's pretty much all. Thanks for listening. We'll see you all next week for another exciting episode of the TTV Podcast. I'm Messinek. I'm Vardaran. I'm LJ. I'm Kahi. I'm Venom. And I'm Purple Dragon. And farewell, everybody. Civil War hype next month. Uh, Hashtag oh yeah, down with BBS. <laughs> Bye. Bye.